What's up, guys? One guy. Hopefully, What's, one guy. Which guy? I don't know. A guy. You're sending this to one guy? I'm sending it. I'm posting it for one guy. Oh, okay. It could be any guy. Any guy. <laughs> Goddamn. Um, you gonna do it? Yeah, I'm down to go to bed. I was. I was down to go to Seattle, Seattle because of the weather. And I was yeah. like, oh, it's kind of like hobby, but. I'm not down with whatever. If we go to Bend, there's not gonna be any clouds because it's in the desert. That's fair. You know what I did last night? What? Um, wait, wait. You gotta take this south. Thank. Thanks. Got it. Nice. Um, I learned how to pole dance a little bit. Oh, oh God. shit, really? I learned how to pole dance a little bit last night. You went with Anna? No, I was at a house party and then uh, yeah. my friend's friend, whose house it was, basically has a pole in his garage. And yeah, I learned a lot. Yeah. It was fun. Nice. So we should go. Pole dancing? I got some level three moves down. I don't know, apparently. man. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I might For be... me to make it sexual and clean and nice, though, I don't know. I didn't work it out. I might be out. Why? I think it's so fun. Pole dancing? It's so fun, dude. I already got too many hobbies. And honestly, you don't have no. I don't think I need anything else. You're good, dude. You're going to be back on Twitch any second now. I don't know about that. <laughs> Wait, how much is it? It was five dollars. Is it really? Wait, is it really? That's what the sign says. Yeah, Where's the sign? Oh my god, you're right. I don't know. Well, I don't no, know about five dollars. Now it's only four dollars for the next person. I only have $4. Maybe you can uh, beg for money. <laughs> no, I walk away. They said it's a winner every time, but I feel like I'm the only loser. Yeah, you lost. <laughs>
We're at the last blockbuster. You ready? You can go inside? Can you leave us? Hey, why is this blockbuster so nice? Oh my god, Cotto. I'm now realizing it's just a souvenir shop. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, They're like two movies. Well, honestly, oh my gosh. I was like, wow, this is like home. I was like, wait a minute, what's wrong with this blockbuster? <laughs> <laughs> well, this is pretty cool. Doesn't know what she's she doesn't about. know the difference between the naked bike ride, TNR, and pedal pool as well. Cancel her. <laughs> <laughs> you just want food. Food time for Kyle. Kyle wants dinner. Dinner time! Hi, Ted. Dinner time, dinner time, dinner, dinner, dinner. dinner. Let's be caught up and watch our movie. That's like about half. Okay. I feel like you get more hangry than anybody else. Would. Oh, that squirted you in the face, dude. This is another night of camping. Dude, I feel like you get too hungry, you know? You don't think so? I don't overeat, so you shouldn't. We're on a diet. We're poor. <laughs> I overeat all the time. I can help you apply some food substance. Yeah, why don't you go apply for for food stickers, huh? Ricardo? You want to? Ricardo? What if I gave you a budget to buy whatever food you want? Instead of reaching out for that? <laughs> you gonna make money? Dude, if you saw what some other dogs were eating on Instagram, you'd leave me so quick. Enough rice for two cups or one and a half. What's up? Yeah. What's up, dude? Turn time. I'm gonna use some of this to scoop. I already forgot to bring a spoon for myself. Hi, dude. Dude, I gave you some rice. You didn't appreciate the rice. Sporks, they really don't get that much soup. Sporks are not good for spooning. They're really not That's good. what a girl told me once. Yeah. yeah. You can be clean up crew, okay? Got it, got it. What's this called? Mm, kimchi chicken. Any recipes on that? There's lots, yeah. 
can you teach me how to make? Yeah, it's pretty simple. But I make like a little stock before I come. But it's pretty easy. Teach me how to make the teach me how to buy the ingredients for make mark. Mm. I have more tofu too that I can add in later. Do you buy the kimchi? Yeah. Nice. I used the remainder of mine. I think I made it like three times now. Nice. Three, four times. <gasps> Good save. Holy shit. It's okay. You know what I learned as a secret recipe? If you ever want to make soup and maybe it's like a little bland like this. Add. You add. Uh, all you gotta do is add one little thing. Flavor. Oh. Ramen seriously. <laughs> But you got the best one. Shouldn't run. <laughs> onions. You okay with onions? Yeah. Kato oh, can't have any onions. Really? Yeah. That's crazy. Caro. What? Yeah, soft, medium, Me medium firm. I know. Evil. Oh my god! <laughs> I quit. <laughs> oh my god! You can't. You really can't beat ramen. <laughs> My mistake. Where are we going? We're starting here. K. Up this trail. K. Ooh, to the, the Nar Lake. Moraine Lake, yeah. Should be really pretty. Let's go. Is it this way or that way? It's that way. A cougar was porting. Hello. Hello. Morning. Morning. All right, Cottle. Yeah, start walking. You know. This is our morning hike. We've had a rough start to the day. Oh my God, my knees. Your knees hurting? <laughs> no, I should have brought the, the brace. The uphill is gonna help. I should have brought the brace though. Damn, I should have just wore the brace. I'm gonna have to carry you out of here. You might. Jesus. Damn, I thought it was good. My knee's still hurting. Honestly, I think all PNW is kind of surreal to me still. Wow, all your stuff is blue, I just realized. You're a Smurf. You are a big Smurf. It's amazing. And we're over here orange. Oh my god, Kyle, we're orange. Are orange people? What? Who's orange? Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Yeah? We're at a crossroad, Cotto. What do we do? Which way do we take? Hey, kid.
you think they'll pick up my phone and bring it back to me? Just shout it. That's funny. Oh god, cut! Vroom! Vroom, vroom, vroom! Dude, these views are like, oh god, I'm gonna die. The views here suck, dude. I hate it. This is what retired Blockbuster employees are up to. You know, we shut down the What's store. What's your life like? We shut down the store in 97, and I've just been out here watching, hiking with my VHS tapes. Oh. None of them are rewinded. They're actually torn, and he's going to go out and talk and use this portable DVD player. You know they have an adult section in Blockbuster? Oh, yeah, they do. Roanoke. No way. Okay. Yeah. Lynchburg. Yeah, nice. Cool. That's so funny. I just commented on her. I wasn't even going to say anything. I was like, I should comment on her hat. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Well, have a great day, guys. Good to see you. Yeah. Have a good one, y'all. Oh, shit. Good, good luck. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Anybody but Virginia, for real. Yeah, thanks, you too. How long are you out here for? A week here. A week here and another week uh, Moab. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's amazing. Moab's amazing too, so you'll love it. Yeah, we're going to try the Slick Rock Trail. Oh, yeah. I was I was there a few months ago. It's amazing. You're going to love it. Yeah. Cool. Hopefully it's not too hot. Me too. Yeah. Stay, stay, stay. Yeah, cool. Cool, good luck. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. And I like your shirt. Yeah, shirt. Yeah, thanks. Right yeah. <laughs> what were your thoughts on that conversation I just had? Really long. I know. But the fact that you let it keep going, even at the end you asked them another question, I was like, oh my god. It wasn't that long. I was definitely trying to get out of it at the end though. Why did you ask that last question? <laughs> I was being polite, dude. <laughs> yeah. I was like, wow, that's country people for real. Countryside. Midwest. That's what my whole childhood was. Southern like. people. Talking to people about Virginia Tech. I know. So much pride. Virginia Tech people are very proud. This is why I never wear a Virginia Tech shirt because then I would have to have a conversation about it every single day. You brought it up. I did. You did. You I brought the Virginia Tech part. I didn't expect. She was from Clemson. Yeah, we can't go ahead. That. That's all no, I'm saying. You got sucked in. Once they said Virginia Tech, I knew I was in. I knew. I had to commit. It's part of my heritage, dude. Why is that part of your heritage? It's the culture there, dude. Where's the ghetto culture? How do you have that and the ghetto culture? I have it all, dude. I have it all. We're eating more than one chip at a time. Yeah, dude. That's how you triple scoop. <laughs> yeah, but you never had this. <laughs> I never had this player. I had Lunchables once or twice in my life. There's no way my parents were showing up for this. What about when you went on field trips? Which, ironically, they spent more money on the food that I ate. They do too, on my field trips. Yeah. I come in so bougie. I come in with two of these. Uh-huh. Maybe like, um, not like an energy drink, but like a Gatorade, because that was cool for kids. And then I'd come in with even like a whole, not a Pringles can, but like yeah. the Hot Cheetos Meteor Shower Balls. And then home food. Yeah. I would have two Lunchables and home food. <laughs> That's not lucky, dude. I ran cross country in high school. I spent twenty dollars on lunch every day. I see kids that do that. Yeah. They go to, like the snack bar. We had a la carte. You had could get the normal poor people lunch, or you could get the a la carte lunch, which was way more expensive. I always got the a la carte, and every day I would get chicken tenders. Which is a full meal. Dude, you're one of those kids. Pizza, which is a full meal. A Gatorade, a cookie, and like two gummies. And sometimes I would go back for a second pizza. I've never had that luxury. <laughs> and then, 
<laughs> you asshole. By five o'clock, I was fucking hungry again, dude. And I was so skinny. The amount of food that I would eat is really catching up with me now. Because I don't run as much. I used yeah. to try to trade my food up in the cafeteria scene. I spend $20 on lunch every fucking day. There's no way I could ever do that. If I left my card at home and I have my lunch card, then there's no lunch that day. <laughs> I think I got bit. By what? I don't know. Do I dessert? Yes. Heck yeah. That's not humans. That literally says puppies and dogs. You didn't do it. Ooh, he's got a garlic in here. I don't watch his daddy do food. How's it taste? It's kind of like... A jerky biscuit. Jerky business? <laughs> biscuit. Those hot, maybe sexy meals. Hot dogs or legs? Hot dogs or legs? Yeah, hot dogs or legs. Um, hot dogs. Hot dogs. Can't eat legs. Can't eat legs, bitch. Can't eat legs. Where are we? Right here? Yep. Perfect. Up. Come on. Come. Up. All the way. All the way. Up. 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 There you go, baby. Oh, my God. Ready? Got to Look here. Smile. We're going to go down. How are you? What's a PSA? Give me a PSA. PSA ant is really high. Eight and a half out of ten. There's flies. There's flies? I don't want. Rose Wait. has to go find Jack at the bottom of the ship while it's sinking. How do we know where to go? We're going that way. So Rose goes to the bottom of the ship, swims through the cold ocean water, cuts Jack free with a hatchet. Wait, he was in the ocean water? Yeah, because he was at the bottom of the ship. The ship's sinking. He's in the water. Oh, wait, how did we get to the end? What happened in the whole middle area? They fell in love. I told you that. You said you fell in love and then you just get to the end there. <laughs> no, the middle part is they fall in love. Then he gets arrested. Then... Wait, he got arrested because he was framed. Oh he no, framed. he is guilty though. No, he's not guilty. He I thought he stole the necklace. No, his... Uh, Rose's fiance plants the necklace. Oh, he actually pocket. never stole it. He actually never stole it. He's getting free money. But here's the thing, Rose doesn't know for a fact if he stole it or not. She has to figure out who to believe. And Jack insists that it wasn't him and rose is like shrug and so then, wait she didn't choose one or the other no she didn't not at first and then the ship starts sinking and she says i knew in my heart that you didn't steal it that doesn't make sense wait that's kind of fucked up yeah this then she goes the time she didn't believe in him she goes save him by the time they get back to and the, she wait, wait wait yeah you're telling me yeah. She didn't believe him. She didn't. She did. And then when he give, she never, gave his life for her, she, she still didn't make it up for him? No. She risked her life to save him. She risked her life to go to the bottom of the ship to save him. Otherwise, he was going to die. Oh. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. So then by the time they go rescue him and get back to the top of the ship, the ship's like about to sink. Right. It's like half in the water. And they go down. Jack's like, we gotta stay on the ship as long as possible. They go down together into the water. And there's- Oh, I thought they were in the water already. No, this they the entire get, time. They get out of the water. Then this entire time, time, I thought the plot you were telling is all underwater. <laughs> they get back, they're in the water and then they get back on the ship. They're like in the, they're in the cabin of the ship. 
Oh. But the cabins fill it up with water. Okay. So okay. then they go up to the upper decks that aren't flooded yet. Dude, I thought I misheard you again. I thought you said they jumped out into the water and then they jumped back onto the ship. No, they went to the lower part of the ship that had already flooded. It was full of seawater. Okay. Ocean water. Then the ship finally sinks. They're the last people on the ship when it sinks. I see. So they have a leg up on it. Is that when the musical score comes in? Yeah, the musical people are playing. Right when like they're at the tip and they're sinking and then she says, I will survive. And then Jack says, Rose, you got to survive no matter what. So they get in the water. And once you touch the water, you only have like five minutes to live before you freeze to death. You have five in a fruit limb? You have five minutes to live before you freeze to death. Okay. Yeah. Get it? You have five minutes to freeze. Before you Then you're frozen. Yeah. And death. And death. Got it. (laughs) But... This is the most controversial part of the whole movie. They find a door floating in the water. And... Who finds it? Who? They were both in the water. Oh, and they both, both came the up at the same time? They're both in the water. They're wearing life jackets. Yeah, they came up at the same time. They find a door floating in the water. Jack finds it. He says, Rose... And he says, finders keepers. <laughs> and he says, <laughs> he says, Rose, get on this door. And Rose calls on the door... And Jack tries to get on it, but it keeps capsizing and flipping over. What he meant was that he's the dirt. They had nice screens and they always styled the game in for us. Heck yeah. Cool. It was good luck. I lucked out. I graduated mechanical engineering and now I'm a mechanical engineer, so it's fun. I get to travel, work remotely, so yeah. Yeah. You think you're staying here? For now, yeah. As long as they let me work remotely. Yeah. <laughs> Virginia boy. Oh, <laughs> yeah, let me go straight into the scenic shot real quick. 